you guys it's your girl natalie the one true diamond coming at you with morning chit chat yes it's dark but it is morning chit chat um it's rainy here i mean it's dark and rainy like the <coughs> excuse me like the bottom is gonna fall out in the sky it is raining already but it is terrible here I, and I, when i cut the camera i'm like it's dark you're not gonna be able to see me it's dark <laughs> Okay, so anyway, we're going to have to deal with what we deal with, okay? So, what's been going on um, in the couponing world? Because I sure still have not had a chance to catch up. I'm trying to catch myself back up into my daily routine, I'm telling you. I went to work yesterday, and it was like drag, drag, drag. But then I got back into the swing of things, and... Um, everything, you know, it, it, it worked out okay there. Um, yeah. And I um, saw a deal from Cassandra72 at Food Lion. And I went to Food Lion last night because I wanted to get some stuff to try to prepare my first Ghanaian dish. Okay. So I went to Food Lion and I said, okay, I'm going to pick up the Power A and I'll pick up the cake mixes and all that. Because you're getting like a bunch of them for a great deal because it's been 15 and it automatically takes $10 off. And these things are on sale where you're paying like, I think like a dollar and some change for 15 cake mixes and maybe um, two and some change for the frostings. And you're paying like $4 and some change for the little cans of Cheez-Its. And um, the Power Aids, you're only paying a dollar and some change for them because there's some coupons or something out there. And I went I got the cake mixes and the frostings and stuff. I mixed those all up together. I didn't do like separate, separate. And then I went to look for the power aid and they were out. They hadn't stocked the shelf. So I know people have been tearing that up. Okay. So that's why they didn't restock the shelf. But I think the sale was over with yesterday because a new sale starts this week. So I don't think um, I'll be able to get them. And then so I just, I put the cake mixes and stuff back because I'm like, I'm trying to diet. There's no need of me bringing this in the house. There's no need of it. So I just went back around when I couldn't get the power aids and I put the cake mix back. So I didn't get anything. I didn't get anything from that deal. So <clears throat> I'll just sit and wait for the next deal. Which the power aids, I didn't really need those either, you know. So it's, I have to get myself into the mind frame of stop buying stuff that I don't need that's not facilitating healthy eating, you know. So yeah <laughs> i know <Ugh. laughs> i hate it because <laughs> i had them pick me up to brown and mix and you know i was gonna make them brownies just to show as i'm sitting there on that couch watching tv i was gonna whip up a brownie and throw it in the oven yes i was so Eric, i didn't get any of that but that's a good deal for you guys who have small kids you know you pack lunches after school snacks that was a good deal um, so, but I think it was over with yesterday, the 18th, so, yeah. Sorry I couldn't tell you about it before, but I just found out about it yesterday myself, and sorry. We'll have to wait for the next deal. <laughs> and I, um, what else did I do? That's it. Oh, my first Ghanaian dish. I was trying to make. You heard me say trying, so you know I messed it up, right? I was trying to make rice with cabbage, green peppers, red peppers. It's the sweet onions and um, the green onions, the green spring onions. The um, What else is in there? Tomatoes and tuna. And you kind of mix it all up into a dish. Okay. It's supposed to be kind of dry. Like I put too much water in mine, I think, because when I put the rice in, I was like, okay, now I got more vegetables than I do rice, so it's going to overtake it. So I put some more rice in, then I put some more vegetables in, and I just totally messed it up. I did. Um, and then I didn't season it enough with their flavor, with the seasonings I bought back. I didn't put enough seasoning in it. So it tasted a little bland. So you know me, I had to add a little salt and pepper to it, try to spice it up. Um, <clears throat> it wasn't that bad, actually. But it's just that it wasn't the consistency like theirs be. Um, I had really too much. I had cooked the rice a little too much. So 
but I'll get it perfected. I will have it done. It will be perfected, okay? And guess what? I bought that epic fail for lunch today because I had made a whole pile of that stuff. I can't waste that stuff. Or I can't waste it. I'm sorry. If it was totally terrible, I would not eat it. I would throw it away for sure, for sure, for sure. But it does not taste bad once you doctor it up. And I think I need to add something hot and spicy in it. To, um, well, I'm not going to do anything else with it. The next time, I'm going to try to add maybe hot pepper or, or um, some kind of cayenne pepper. Something hot. Because they always have like a spicy taste. And I did get a cookbook, but that recipe wasn't in there. I was trying to go on remembrance of what I remembered it tasting like um, when his sister had made it. So, I just think I need to add something hot to it to give it that little spice. I think that's the flavor that was missing, the hotness. So yeah, no, I don't want to go here. Turn that wrong stop. So yeah, so um, I'm practicing on it. I'm trying to get it down pat. <coughs> Excuse me. My next dish I plan on making, which will be later in the week, I want to do banku with the um, with that um pepper soup that they do. I want to try to do that. Some banku with the pepper soup. Yeah. With fish. <laughs> yes, with fish, yes. <sighs> I'm gonna see can I do it. I'm gonna try that. Okay. If I can I might put chicken in it though. And maybe not fish. Yeah. I don't know. Fish salmon, I'll put something. Sometimes they put fried fish in it. In the in the soup and yeah, so I don't know. It'll be some type of fried fish or something. Maybe. Or maybe I'll put just a piece of salmon. I'm not sure what I'm going to put in there. I don't know. But I'm going to try to make that later on in the week. I didn't put any pictures up. I didn't post anything because I'm not going to post anything until I get it to the point where it looks like someone will say, oh, I want to try that. That rice. Mm. It just... Uh, it looked like mush, so I'm like, okay, mush. I can't put mush. <laughs> I sent a picture. I sent a picture to my baby. He was like, you put too much water in it. He could tell from just looking at the picture. I'm like, I know. He was like, you'll get it right, baby. I was like, I, I know. I'll have it right by the time you come. So, yeah. Miss Natalie and her trying to cook it. See, and let me tell y'all, I'm so used to cooking rice in a rice cooker that I measure it out and put it in the rice cooker, and that's it. I haven't cooked rice on the stovetop in years because I have my rice cooker, and I love my rice cooker because it cooks rice perfect and it cooks it perfect every time. But what I did, I use regular rice when I'm cooking on the stovetop. It's best for me to use Uncle Ben's because Uncle Ben's cook perfect every time. So I think that's what I need to do is just get Uncle Ben's rice from now on when I'm going to cook on the stovetop. Because I never I never can mess up Uncle Ben's rice. So, yeah. Yeah, so that's what I need to do. So that's what I think I'm going to do for the next time I try to write, make the rice and cabbage with the vegetables and all that. So, yeah. So, yeah. But anyway, you guys, don't have much to talk about. Then coupon. Have not looked at any coupon videos. I know there's a good deal on Shutterfly that ends today. You can get 101 free prints shipped to your home. I'm not sure how much the shipping cost is. I thought I kind of glimpsed someone saying that they could ship it to a store. But I can't remember if they said Target. You could ship it to Target. And I think you could get free pickup there. So it'll be totally free for you. I think that's what they said, but I have to check it out. So I'm going by this morning to get my computer from my son so that I can try to do it at work because today's the last day. And you have to use the code, it's Shutterfly, and you have to use the code Snow Day, S N O W D A Y, so that you get pictures of your snow days. Okay? So um, that's what I'm trying to do now so I can download pictures of my trip. Plus, I need to try to compose a video, like I promised you guys of all the um of the trip stuff so i will um be talking with you guys later because i have to run in here and get this computer so i will talk with you later 
y'all remember to always give God praise, give him some thanks, and y'all have a wonderfully blessed day. As always, remember to have a wonderfully blessed day, and I will see you in the next video, okay? Bye.